This year, girls have been able to access football much more easily through my employment and also just the persona that football has now. So through having funding provided by the Ray Lowe Sporting Foundation, they've been able to increase participation and give qualified coaching to all the girls. I turned up to a session and to start with a normal player tag game. I like to come up with some fun games that more than just the original and traditional tag games. So with the films that come out, Frozen was a massive hit. So I came up with a game that's Frozen Tag. So the girls actually get to be characters from the film and run around and play tag. And they get really excited by that. At the start, I don't normally give them a football because it's their first week. But as they progress, they'll play the same tag game, but they'll actually have a ball at their feet and they won't realise that they're actually playing football whilst playing tag. So we'll do a bit of a tag game to get them warmed up and then go into a different skill each week. We'll go through dib dribbling, tackling, passing, shooting and then gameplay as well. So each week I'll focus on a different aspect and I'll just do little fun activities together in a group or on their own to get used to having the ball at their feet and used to playing and then I'll just let them play. There's been a massive increase in numbers from girls that are actually receiving qualified coaching in football. They have an absolutely amazing time. They'll be smiling the whole time and they'll be giggling and it's all about having fun. There's no pressure on them at all to become the next England captain for women's football. There's nothing at all like that. It's just I want them to have fun and learn a new skill. I make new friends, most of them, because sometimes it's all the different classes that come together and sometimes they don't really know the girls from the other classes. So they're making new friends within their school as well and they just smile throughout the whole session, which is fantastic to see. One thing that we're trying to do this year is build our own image of girls' football. So we're not copying boys' and men's football. It's something a bit different. It's a lot calmer, more friendly environment and a bit more feminine. We've put on festivals for the girls to come down to. So we've had fun activities for them to practice all their different skills, learn something new. We've had coaching from coaches that have come over from England specifically just to put on the event and match play. But one important thing that we've also done, we've also incorporated face painting and hair braiding into it as well, just to attract those girls that are slightly bit put off by thinking of football. So just trying to build that thing up where girls football and women's football, it is different to men's football, so please don't be put off.